Hey guys, this is Evan Laux from Engine Builder Mag. We're here at the Ultimate Callout Challenge. I'm joined with Chris Patterson from Unrivaled Diesel Performance. He's got a sweet 6.7 Cummins here with the triple turbo setup. It's our Diesel of the Week. Engine Builder's Diesel of the Week is sponsored by Amsoil, the first in synthetics. Chris, thanks for joining us here. Uh, everybody's kind of preparing to get to the pool in here, so it's kind of chaotic. Why don't you tell us a little bit about your setup here? Uh, you got the triple turbo on 6.7. Yeah, 6.7 uh, Cummins. It's a Hamilton competition modified high test block. DJ stage three cylinder head, DJ connecting rod, billet cam, flux diesel, 450% comp hybrid injectors, twin 14 race pumps, an 8396 PS triple ball bearing on the manifold, and two TDI force conduction 7687 10s on the atmosphere. And obviously now we're getting ready for pulling. As far as the rest of the weekend goes, drag race and dyno. As far as your expectations, how did you perform with the truck here? Well, honestly, it was below my expectation. But that's probably a fault of mine that I have very high goals. Uh, we wound up running a 57 at 5,500 pounds, and we chewed up the transmission doing it, and then we turned it up once we fixed it, and we kicked the tire and slid across the lane, and we the vent full. And then on the dyno, we applied VHT to the tire, and that was a bad idea. I kind of noticed you did about five or six pulls there, a little more than most of the guys that were doing uh, the dyno. Most of them been doing that. Well, I'm really, really hard headed and I was not willing to quit. So I kept bringing the nitrous across uh, a longer ramp to try to bring it in slower, but the amount of nitrous we were using was just extremely violent. And the triples come on so quick, and they are small compared to all those other competitors. So when it makes power, it's almost instantaneous. It's just really hard to hold it to the roller. We spun a lot, ultimately, we wind up pushing the burden. But during all those runs, we had 0.2 psi crankcase pressure, and we had 168 degrees. Well, that's a good No, we kind of have a pulling setup. We run preloads in the front. Obviously, the weight box, we had to reinforce the frame a lot. Every time we pulled, we bent the frame and caught on fire. And then solid rear, just the tires, you know, kind of normal setup. Nothing, nothing crazy. Great. Hey, Chris, we wish you good luck moving Thank forward you. here. Guys, this has been your Diesel of the Week. We're here with Chris Patterson. Make sure to check out Unrivaled Diesel Performance. Follow Engine Builder Mag for more great diesel and engine content. Thank you.